Hello, um, audience. Um, this is a science project created by me. With Eric. I'm Eric. Yeah, and I'm this is Luke. Luke. And I'm Zach. Okay. Today's topic is artificial gravity. Now, Luke, what is artificial gravity? Artificial gravity is man-made gravity. And um, how will this help in space travel and the mission to Mars? It will help because artificial gravity gives benefits to the bones because it won't damage them and, and it will take a year or two to go to Mars. And their muscles won't weaken. Yes. As well. And give us a few examples of artificial gravity on Earth. It will uh, be like a bucket which is spinning around, a test tube spinner. And the thing is a sport where you spin a ball and it yes, flies. Yes, it's about distance. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because you spin around and you throw it. Yes. And there is also the washing machine. Yes. yes. It's if you notice on the washing machine, the clothes stick, stick to the edges. Yes. If it's um, deserved at a very high rate. Now. We are going to do an experiment with a bucket and uh, tennis balls. They're not, they're not stuck. They're, there's, no, there's no editing. Just to make, just to prove to you that and that's not magic. It's not and magic. also, we did not edit it. Yeah, one take. So uh, Zachary, you gonna give me the camera? Uh, uh here. Um, you spin the bucket. Zachary's gonna yeah. spin the bucket. Three, two, two, one. Now get the momentum. As you can see, the the tennis balls are not are not uh, falling off and sticking to the to the floor of the bucket. This uh, will revolutionize space travel by by creating artificial gravity. Now uh, um, that's the, the uh, end. end. It was made by no. Luke, Zachary, and I, Merrick. So, uh, bye. See you later. Bye.